Children in schools will see art as art. They will see maths as maths. They don't seem to see that they actually, are, there are links between them all. The faculties do work together. In our STEM clubs, it certainly is cross-fertilisation. There are people who would, who are not normally work together, which is good for the school because they become closer colleagues. You don't realise how much other people have got to offer. Even as myself as a maths teacher, um, you think you're linking things with your subject, but actually, when you actually go out and see other people doing subjects, you really understand where the maths fits in. These subject boundaries are entirely artificial. And if you bring them all together, I think that the topic has much more relevance and meaning to a student. Unless students can see that the skills they're learning in each subject area are transferable, then they're not actually going to be able to use what they're learning very effectively. And it became clear that it was something that we could do to interest the students and to um, inspire them to do something and become more creative in the subjects they do particularly since science and maths is, is sort of quite theory heavy. Um, and it's nice to give those type of students um, the opportunity to do something more practical and to put what they learn to good use. In a school like this, D&T is an option and we want things that will sort of hook students fairly early on and sort of um, take them forward and want to opt for it in years 10 and 11. It links science, technology, engineering, mathematics to their real, real life, to, to the real world concepts that they're going to be facing. It's made me think more about where, what, why we are teaching particular elements of maths and able to put it into context as well for students and have more of a practical insight as to where it's used rather than just staying in my little maths block. <laughs> you get like, an opportunity to do this where like, you wouldn't anywhere else. Well, STEM clubs can suit any sort of student. It gives them a real opportunity to do lots of practical things and get their hands dirty, which they might not otherwise have the chance to do strictly in lesson time. I'm a very math sort of person. Um, science beforehand, no, but I've, um, I've really developed my science throughout the years that I've been involved in STEM. Um, the engineering I've become quite interested in as well. Sometimes in school there's so much of a focus on core subjects that subjects that are within STEM, which are equally useful, equally um, a route into employment, further education, they're just uh, maybe slightly overlooked and it was a good way of sort of really embracing all those subjects and encouraging students to look at sort of some wider options.